Tell me again why this was a good idea. The army's in here. Gotta have food to share. There shouldn't be zombies inside the fences, right? Better question? Where are all the people? No way. They can't all be gone. They sure left a lot of stuff behind. Oh, fuck me. to explore the camp wasn't so good after all. Too many Z's behind us to go back now. You might as well keep looking around. You should definitely find a better weapon than your knife. That'll come in handy. Even after this long, people kept hoping to find their families again. Yeah, just like Mom hoping you'd come home when she got sick. Didn't happen either. 
I had a job and a life, unlike some people. Somebody had to take care of her. The show wasn't gonna be you. I'm not getting into this again. Not now. Is this place creepy as fuck? That's what. Locked. Dang it. Just like the gooey one we saw outside the gate. <sighs> it bit me. I got gunk all over my shirt. Now that is a tragedy. I guess even a zombie apocalypse can't stop red tape. Shit, the spider's really itching. You always did fuss over every little scratch. Oh my god. What the hell happened here? Oh, god. What a mess. Is it just me, or did it suddenly get really hot? Maybe we can find you some medicine if we keep looking. That'll come in handy. is useful, but it won't do anything for that fever. Yo, that's a lot of zombies. We can get past them if we're quiet. Go! 
you two doing? Not supposed to be any civilians here. We thought the army might have food. Where did everyone go? Whoever's still in charge shut it down, pulled everybody out. The army's gone, kiddo. Lucky for you, I stuck around to keep an eye out for anyone left behind. Oh, fuck, I feel terrible. I just want to lay down and die. Hon, you don't look so good. My brother was bitten. I, I think it's infected. Got any medicine? I've seen this before. You need something special. Go find the doc over at the SMB. Tell him I sent you. Aren't supposed to be any civilians left in the camp. I always knew she was a softie. What do you need? My brother is sick. I think it might be serious. Uh huh. Uh, you'd better come with me. This is like the one that bit me. What's wrong with it? We call it the blood plague. It's contagious to humans and it takes you while you're still alive. Are you saying that's what's gonna happen to me? Well, probably, but maybe not. Hey, you! Come here. You have a flashlight? Look for a sample case in there and bring me whatever you find. I've been researching blood plague with some other civilians. We found a cure that works if you use it soon after infection. The army took our lab when they left, but they didn't get everything. Did you find it? No cure? Damn. I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc, shit's getting bad out there. Thanks to all the noise, the Zeds are swarming the perimeter. This camp is done for. It's time for us to go. All of us. You know I can't leave Jamie. If you stay, I gotta stay. Then we both die. Jamie's gone. But this kid still needs your help. Okay, fine. Just give me a second. Make it quick. We don't have much time. Before we go, I need your help. That thing in the cage? It was a person once. I tried to reverse the effect, but we ran out of time. I don't have it in me to do what I should. Maybe you do? I'm sorry. I hope you're in a better place now. Listen, I know we've had our problems, but please, don't let me turn into one of those things. You're my brother. I have your back. Always. Thank you. I'm sorry I wasn't stronger. All right, time to go. Big sister's got the wheel. I heard some rumors about a good place we could pull up. So how do we survive without the army around? We keep going. As long as we stick together, we can survive anything. Sounds like we're empty again. You'd better be close. This is the place. Pull up here. It's not much, but it should keep us safe. Luckily, I don't need that much to get started. Good to know. How are you feeling, little brother? Like I got hit by a truck. This plague shit sucks. Yes, and you need to take it seriously. Get over to the infirmary, okay? Yeah, sure. 
The infirmary. Maybe that'll fix everything. Please tell me he's gonna pull through. He has to. This isn't as good as having the actual cure, but I should be able to keep his blood plague from getting worse for a while. That is, if we can keep our supply of meds from running out. Damn it, this isn't fair! Hey now, don't panic. The doc has this under control. I know how to make a cure that'll work. That's not the issue. I just need more plague samples. My lab didn't have enough. I think I saw a place where we can find all the samples you'll need. Hey, see you later. Hey there, stranger. You want to give me some help for a sec? Following you. It could be worthwhile to climb up and get a better look around. I've looked around, and I can say it's promising. We should make some time for scavenging runs. I like that idea. We should prioritize buildings that have what we need most. Bloater, don't let it get too close. Got a screamer here. That should do it. Looks like nobody else is home. That won't work. This is it. Okay. I'm not letting you down. 
Not like I let Mom down. the plague sample we need. Okay, I brought back the sample. How's he doing? I'm starting to think dying would be better than this. Relax. Everything will be fine. And you, please drop the sample in our supply lock. We now have enough plague samples to make the cure for my brother. We should get on that as soon as possible. Okay, I have the cure in hand. No more lying around for you. Not to stress you out or anything, but I'm still kind of dying here. We don't know if it'll work, but it can't make things worse. Thanks. It's nice to see someone still cares. <sighs> Thank you. Because of us working together, my brother is alive. As long as we stick together, I have a feeling we'll be in this for the long haul. These damn Z's almost took my little brother. And that pisses me off. I'm not gonna be happy until we've cleared them out of this whole town. We can probably find a lot of them if we track down a screamer. I saw one on our way into town. We should worry about our base before we go out hunting Zeds. For this place to be functional, we need to upgrade it with some building materials. Stuff's really gonna slow down around here unless we get more fuel.
Now that's worth scavenging for. I do not want that bloater getting too close. Looks like the screamer I saw has gathered some friends. Finally, quiet. Remind me why we're doing it. We gotta clear that infestation before it gets worse. Get it on. Station is history. There's more to be done, but it's a good start. long-term survival, we need friends. Let's get on the radio and see who else lives around here. How about I carry that rucksack for I worried about everything, and I mean everything, especially the shit I had no control over. I guess the apocalypse just out of me. The world's even scarier, but now I know we can get through it. I 
had some extra time, so I made myself useful. That screamer could bring a lot of trouble if I'm not careful. Let's hope this place has the materials we need. That doesn't feel like the right priority for us. This is about our home. That has to be our priority. The moon, though. Sweet. Now it's time to bring these materials home. How about I carry that rucksack for you? We're back. Did you miss us? I'm glad you're home. Thanks for handling us. Unless we start whittling bullets, we're gonna need some more ammo. That thing you wanted? I just dropped it off. That should get us started. Thanks. We can use those materials to start building anytime. If we build the workshop, we could keep our weapons from falling apart.
It's really about being self-sufficient. That's critical out here. I'm listening. Whatever, hold up a sec. Catch you later. The best way for us to survive is by heading off potential conflicts before they even get started. If we claimed the nearby military site as an outpost, that would warn away any potential troublemakers. It'd also give us a steady supply of ammo in case anybody doesn't get the message. I showed my ass to a bunch of zombies the other day. Felt kind of good. Busy? I could use a little backup. Lead on. This team really knows how to get things done. Freak spotted. Finally, a real adult. 
spotting in abandoned buildings ain't quite the same thing. Nothing but good times. Snap! This place was made to be outposted. Yes, sir, there it is. Uh-huh. Outpost is done. All fancy and fresh. What's up? been up to. Just let me know if there's anything else we need. You want something? Better check the trunk for a toolkit. I forgot how much stuff we loaded back here. All right, one set of repairs coming up. Guess that's all I can do for now. Seems like it'll run okay. haven for me. When I was there, my imagination just ran wild. Music and computers were my favorite. It was incredible to touch and use neat allies. The skills and resources they offer are vital to our survival. Anyway, 
Music and computers were my favorite. It was incredible to touch and use these things I'd never have otherwise. I'm filling up the tank, or close to it at least. Let's find some place to look for more fuel, okay? A little test drive would let me know if the repairs worked out. Okay, it's working fine. That's a relief. I'd hate to be stuck walking all the time. Driving is faster, safer, and lets me bring back way more supplies. super happy about this aggressive plan of ours. I get what you're saying, but I don't see that we have a choice. Yo, this is bad. I see a bunch of dead army guys walking around here. They're probably wearing bulletproof helmets. Handheld weapons are a better choice here. Relax. I got this.
cobwebs. Oh, thanks. No more zombies over here. Can you get an outpost set up there? People need to know this is our territory. Sweet. This shit is heavy. Post is done. That's great. We'll get a steady supply of ammo from that place, which I expect will come in handy as we expand our territory. done here. Yo, this is your new neighbor, reaching out to say hello. Hit me back if you're up for a little meet and greet. It's a relief to hear another voice. We're in a bit of a bind and could use some help. Can you come by? Ah, you see? We just got here, and we're already making friends. Come on, let's go say hi. They need help. I think we gotta do this. I'm not giving up yet! Oh shit, someone needs a hand. That 
That's what I'm talking about. That new plague heart growing nearby. I owe you for that. Oh, pity. I'm sorry to ask a favor so soon, but our food supply is spoiled. Dear, we'd really appreciate that. How's it going? Yo, wanna trade? Sure. Our neighbors are out of food. It looks bad, guys. Don't we have enough in our storage to share a bit? If not, we should go out and scavenge for more. say being careful is dull, but I say it's a lot more fun than being dead. tired. Oh man, our neighbors are gonna be stoked to see this food.
I think I see someone over there. If we can't find more food, Sif, thanks. You really came through for us. I guess we owe you one. Glad to help. What's up? I got some stuff to trade. How about it? We took a risk, reaching out to strangers like we did. But making connections like that, I think it's how we rebuild the world. Another day, another dollar. Port's coming. Friends is a smart move. They could have good stuff to trade. Honestly, I'd feel better if we handled this problem ourselves. We could build all the tools we need right here, couldn't we? That pack is hunting for something. We don't know for sure if plague sets are created by the heart or just attracted to it. But if we leave this one alone, it's only a matter of time before one of us catches the blood plague. Uh-huh. I hear you. Loud and clear. Hold on a sec. something what up take it easy <laughs> 